What is going on YouTube? It's Crazy Gaming Monkey here, and in this video, we're going to be checking out a brand new game added onto the Game Pass, which is Harold Halibut. We're gonna go ahead and see how the game is together. Let you know my honest opinion on it. Let's see how it is. You know what the vibe is like. Uh, it's a pretty big game. It's about like 30 gigs or so. So I'm assuming it's like a full, full story, like a very, like a open world type of game, possibly. Or we'll see. We'll see how it is. But as always, I hope you have an amazing day today. I hope your week is amazing. Your weekend coming up, hopefully, is the best weekend ever. As always, if you enjoy, smash like, smash subscribe. It would mean a lot to me. And I'll catch you guys right now after this cutscene. So let me zip real quick. Alright, wait, I thought I could control the fish for a second. Alright, there's no talking yet, so I'll just talk. Long time ago, there was a fish or an eel that swam across many oceans, but never saw a sight like this. The eel continued swimming to pose no threat to the unfamiliar, unfamiliar, unfamiliarity of the world. Ah, oh, damn, I can't even speak. Alright, anyways, we're... Interesting, so we live in an under, underground world, underwater world. Hey, Bob! Hey, Billy! Hey, I, let me, uh, I wanna be... Yeah, let me get that one. Yo, it's kind of giving me, hold on. It's kind of giving me, like, claymation vibes. Like, robot chicken type of thing. Is that claymation? No, not, not fully claymation, but... <sighs> It's giving me robot chicken vibes, actually. Interesting. Let me see. So adult stop motion. That's that's what it is. Sketch comedy. It's really giving me that vibe, though. Do you guys agree? I, I mean, I'm not crazy here, right? Let's get to it. Oh, everything just uh, loaded in. Harold, I'm afraid I need you to come with me. Oh, hi, Major. What's the matter? Is that leak bothering you again? It's your fine, your unpaid fine. I had a fine? You still do. Tubing without the proper credit on your tube card. Can you settle it now? Uh, no. But wait, I I'm sure I topped it up. Improper tube card management, Halibut. You surely recall that since last week, the Energy District tubes require your tube card to be topped up with blue credit. If an onward journey to the Social District is intended, in addition to the usual weekly turquoise credit. Wait, but only last month it was a green. I don't make the rules, Harold, but the rules make me. Now let's get you over to the fine secretary so we can all get on with our day. All right, mate. That's how you want to play it. Oh, I'll show you a proper welcome in it. Harold fell foul of the end user insufficient funds clause. I'm afraid if you really can't pay, you're going to have to think of someone who can. I guess that means you'll have to wait for the professor again. Who knows what she sees in you? Right, I'm needed elsewhere. There's a disturbing rise in the number of people traveling without the appropriate tickets recently. I hope for both our sakes not to see you again soon, Harold. I really, okay, I say this about a lot of games, but I really, this, this game has unique art style, like the, like, like the character designs and like the world design is, you could tell like the uh, the little details they're actually like putting into it. It's so crazy, but it looks nice. It's very charming. So, what are you in for? Oh, I'm just here for the great company. Like even the way that they're talking, it's like stop motion. What? No, I meant. Kind of like oh, even Caroline, Caroline vibes. Oh. Yeah. 
you let me wait in peace now? Oh, sure. We'll do. Have fun. Felix? Hi, Ma! Uh, look, before you say anything... Whatever your excuse is, it'll have to wait. Busy, busy times. Mr. Secretary, please charge whatever Felix's fine is to the company tab, please. Of course, Mrs. Van Der Vaart. Have a pleasant day. You too, Master Van Der Vaart. Freedom! Have fun, Harold! We reluctantly interrupt your daily business for an important... <laughs> for some important information for all inhabitants of the Fedora One. Dear people, crew, and company, we seem to have discovered something super cool. Please do consider to congregate tonight at the Agora Theatre to... for some important information. Oh, Harold, here you are. I've been looking all over. Get your buns to the lab, if you please. I do beg your pardon, ma'am, but there is still the matter of an outstanding fine for Mr. Halibut to find a proxy for. A completely reasonably priced and fairly applied fine, if I do say so myself. Sir, please do not cause me further consternation. Just put it on my tab as always. Come on, Harold. All right. Let's get to it. I wonder if we're able to no go through any of these doors. Am I able to talk to you? No. Nope. Mr. Halibut, you'll need this before you go. A ticket home? Yes, and only home. It's not valid for any other routes. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Secretary. And your tube pass should be unlocked again within 24 hours. So you'll be back to the luxury of fully automatic tube travel eligibility approval once again. I can't wait. Alright, skedaddle. Every time I need you, Harold, it's something else. What's wrong with you? I can't handle your shenanigans while we're in the middle of this mess. I know, I know. I'm sorry. Next time... This must have an underlying cause. Hmm. I remember when you were still in school and your teacher telling me about how you would just stare out of the window, oblivious to her even shouting at you. It's like you've never snapped out of that daydream. Interesting. I wonder if I'm able to... No. So I just have to follow her everywhere, huh? I was never in a daydream, just... The other stuff was boring. Harold, I'm not sure which is worse. The idea of you living with your head in the clouds or never being excited by life. Only boring people get bored. Eesh. I'm sorry, Professor. Oh, I can't get in there. Does it open up? There we go. Wait, is it the same place? It is! Oh my god. I don't know what I was expecting. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I got it, I got it. I got it, y'all. Alright, let's try this one more time. Central Station. Thanks. You have arrived. Is the Please exit the tube in a quickly manner. Temporarily. We hope you travel with us again soon. But why is tubular? What needs improving? Can I run? I could zoom in. Alright, so the buttons don't do anything. Set LT is just zooms in. Hold on. So will we get discounts on the lines as a result of the inconvenience? As of yet, there is no discount scheme in place. As we calculated the possible inconvenience to be negligible. Wouldn't need a discount if the prices weren't so high in the first place. I can't comment on the pricing strategy, I'm afraid, sir. I'm just a travel secretary. 
So what can you comment on? I am authorised to comment on the nature of the tube closure, which is that all water have had to close the line temporarily for improvement works. Yes, you said that. Have these improvements been carried out before? I cannot say if the exact same optimizations have been made to another line. So what can you comment on? I can confirm that there is no discount scheme in place, and that we believe the fares to be fair. So who calculates the fair, fair price? I can't comment on the pricing strategy, I'm afraid, sir. I'm just a travel secretary. This is ridiculous. Can I talk to your manager? Certainly, sir. If you'd just like to go to the All Water Public Office and make a managerial communication meeting All request water with public Secretary Office. 24 there. The reason, sir, is that All Water have had to close the line temporarily for... All Water. But why is there a line? This location is not accessible via your permission, sir. This is decided. Enjoy the view. Interesting. Interesting. So, okay, I'm trying to like follow along with the story here a little bit. But Harold, I'm tired of chasing after you like you're a stupid butterfly. Hang on, what's a butterfly? That sounds silly. A butterfly is an insect from Earth. They had beautiful patterns on their wings and drank pollen from flowers. I suppose you could say they often appeared in a extra natural moments in life on the other hand they were terribly inefficient flighty overly trusting and delicate ergo you never take responsibility and i never know where to find you next huh okay so we're not from earth so we never see the outside world pretty much i know i drift off a bit sometimes but but all water raised the two fares again and they never announce it properly. This time it really was an honest mistake. Plus, there was this woman who- Quiet, Harold. We don't have time for your flights of fancy right now. There's important work afoot. Oh yeah. Have you checked the blockage in the filter station yet? And did you need to feed the fish too? Ah, uh, yes, those two. I'm on the case. Bye, Professor. <sighs> Aren't you forgetting something? Oh, uh, I'm sure. Those are all my tasks for the day. You seem to have waylaid your PDA. It really is a wonder you get anything done around here. Ah, thanks, Professor. It's got a life of its own. Strangely enough, I noticed you hadn't added your daily task list to it, and I don't want to have to remind you about them again. Oh, thanks. Let's see. Uh, so, I access the list. It'll come back to me. Just go to the four selection buttons. Okay. Um... Where were they again? The upper right of the pad! Ah, uh, yeah. Top of the four buttons, right? Alright. There we go. Cool. Then I use the navigation nub to highlight and then hit the bottom button. Precisely. Okay, great. Loop. And it's the rightmost button to go back. Indeed. And I'll see you at the Agora Arcades when you're done. Dude, all right. All right, interesting. So welcome to do. So I'll clean the filter, uh, like always, and then feed the fish. All right, so where do we clean the filter? All right, nothing to do here. Let's get out of here. Thy filter. Don't know. Alright, let's feed the fish over here first. I'm assuming this is it. Threat. It's out of food. Alright, better ask task. about this. To do a Cyrus. Alright, let's go downstairs, shall we? Wait, is this my bed? 
You guys see that little thing that keeps popping up? Like on the top middle? It's just me. Look. Oh, that. You see that black little square? Interesting, huh? Uh huh. So gotta leave. Wait, what are you doing? Uh, okay. Huh? What do we do now? So confused. What is this? Out of food, yeah. Got Better it, ask that. Cyrus about this. Wait, so what is this for? One, two, three, four. I can't even do anything with that. All right. Let me get out of here. Can I run? Nope. Lab quarters. Uh, lounge, maybe? Are you Cyrus? Ah, Harold. Perfect timing. Oh, Senor Tenenbaum. You too. I was just hoping to watch some Sansu's Ashk. Got any idea how to work the old telly? Yeah, I think it's one of those all-water ad-only models. Ah. Should still be good for watching the announcement on tonight, though, right? You really gonna watch that? They'll just announce another tube price hike again. Well, who knows? Diego from Health Services said he heard something about the reveal of something important. Face masks are specifically treated to allow maximum. What brings you to the lounge anyway? Would you guess that the tubes to the utility district and the social district are down again? Strangely, yes. I can believe that. Does that mean school is out? Yep. The bambinos are happy, and I don't mind the time off. But if it goes on much longer, they'll forget everything. Won't they do their homework? Maybe. The whole social district is off limits right now, so at least there won't be much else for them to do. Is that why you're hanging out here? Mostly. It's just kind of cozy here, though, you know? I suppose it is. Anyway, don't mind me, Harold. Someone's gonna try and steal you. What is Sonsu's Ashk? Yes! Sonsu's Ashk! Eternal love. Best and only Turkish novella we have on board. I thought season 18 was bad, but with all the drama around Emery's cousin and whatnot. It's worth bowering through to season 36, though. That's where the plot really thickens. I'll try to check it out sometime. Bye, Chris. See you later, Harold. I'll be here if you want some company. All right. Thank you. Let's go downstairs now. Let's see. WC. Holly Woman's restroom. Oops, my bad. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's just light. You know, he kind of looks like Anton from the from that one movie, No Country for Good Good Men or something. No more. No more. Ah, uh, some I forgot, bro. I'm gonna just show. No country for good man. Something like that. Wait, what is this? What is this area? Hello. Hey, Sai. Oh, no, hey, you're Sai. Uh, what's going? I, I mean, uh, how's up? Just doing my usual rounds. Trying to clean the fish and feed the filter station. Super nice. How are the fishies doing? They're swimming away, looking good. But there's no food left in the fish feeding machine. Ah, lovely. I've been thinking about fish a lot recently. I've been wondering if, you know, even fish blood is such a good fertilizer, what does the slow release phosphates and nitrogen? But we don't want to hurt fish. If samples were taken, we could somehow synthesize the. Sigh, sigh. That sounds very interesting. But what about the food for the fish themselves? Hmm? Oh, yes. Sorry, Brat. Didn't I restock the other night? <sighs> Must have just thought about it. I'll have to formulate some more. You make the fish food yourself? Oh, I do indeed. 
I'm working on a new recipe at the moment, in fact. But, I mean, can fish even taste? It's not just about taste, it's about nutrition. We want their gills to function optimally, don't we? And their pigments to express as vividly as possible, a bit like flowers. Sigh, sigh. New fish food would be great. I'm sure they'll love it. Well, I'll get right on it. Promise. Yeah, I think I have a test batch. Uh, yep, here. A uh, little taster to keep them going. Uh, you should try some, too. Uh, thanks. I'll let you know what they think. All right. Thank you. We're free out here. Oh. Did you see that? Was that fish real? Well, I'm not sure. I mean... Even if it wasn't, their methods are getting way more sophisticated lately. Yeah. Mm, I kind of look forward to seeing what stunt they're going to pull next. Me too. As long as I don't have to clean it up. Do you remember their first messages? Ha, uh, yeah. Wasn't it something about Fedora not being able to take off being a conspiracy? Yes, on all those little flyers. Handwritten, too. What did that fish message mean, do you think? Hmm. I guess something about exploring the planet? Didn't it say what's out here? Ooh, like they've hidden something. Maybe they think the ocean is a conspiracy too? Hmm, maybe. Alright, so we gotta go back up. The light keepers. Gotta go back up to feed the fishies. What's down here though? Can I go down here? Uh, to do Feed the fish, clean the filter station. Wait. Uh, like always. Right. I don't know where the filter station is though. I'm just gonna do. Oh, filtration. Oh, there we go. Anything in here? Nope. Hopefully, yeah, this is it. Seems like it. We gotta go in here? Question mark. Over here, maybe? Ah, yes. around the buttons, eh? Clean as a whistle again. Is that it? I guess so. Hold on. Can I go inside? No, I can't. Alright. That's about it. Now, let's just go back up. The way he's hunched, bro. It's funny. Let's just go back up so we can feed the fish. So, so far, what I'm getting off of this game, it's a very slow-paced game. Definitely more for the story. So, if you are more trying to relax, have a slow-paced game, you know, are intrigued with, you know, storytelling and all that good stuff, Definitely might be a might be a game for you. Um, I feel like because they are setting it up, it does it is starting off a bit slow. But that's okay because I feel like furthermore the story is gonna get more interesting. It's gonna be talking about like this whole world thing and like how they're probably gonna discover Earth or what had happened. You know what had happened to Earth and all that good stuff. So yeah. I definitely like the, the animations You're and the art style. Is now served. The art style of the game, for sure. Okay, Herald Bot Diagnostic Report. Scanning. Scanning. All tasks completed satisfactorily. Enjoyment evaluation. Minimal. Energy levels depleted. 
recharging required. Next destination, Agora Arcades. Agora Arcades, alright. Really wish we could run in the game though. Would make traveling a little bit easier. Or faster. Flip the switch, bud, come on. Get out of here. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I wonder I wonder how like the game is gonna not end, but like how the story is gonna be. If it's gonna be like an eerie story, like a very suspenseful type of game. Like like what's going on, you know? Why isn't this working? So typical. I suppose the ticket reactivation is still going to take a while. Hmm. Complete or go to the... We didn't complete that, bro. What's going on? Alright, we gotta watch the announcement. Alright, well. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said, if you're into... You know, more story games. Very slow paced. Um, not really a lot of action, more like moving around type of thing, walking simulator type of stuff, then this game might be for you. I do like it. I am not opposed to it. I am actually intrigued to finding out what the story is more about, uh, or what the story is. Like, want to know more about the story pretty much. Uh, but yeah, I, re I really like the, the art style, the animations and all that stuff. It really reminds me of like Robot Chicken for some reason. Or like claymation, like stop motion stuff. Uh, but yeah. Anyways, I hope you have an amazing day today. If you enjoyed, consider leaving a like, consider subscribing. And let me know down in the comment section what you guys want to see. What you guys want to see more of. You know, feel free to speak your mind. I'm always here. Adios. Love you guys. Peace.